Hello and welcome to Kindred Spirit Tarot. This is your daily message for all zodiac signs for Wednesday the 18th of July 2018. Thank you so much for joining me. If it's your first visit, welcome. If you are returning, then welcome back and thank you. For today's reading, I am using the Fairy Tarot by Doreen Virtue and Radley Valentine. Okay, Let's see if we can get a little bit of fairy dust going today. Right. It's actually a little bit cooler here today. Thank heavens. And we did have a little bit of rain again yesterday, so all is not lost. <laughs> okay, what is the message for my wonderful friends from Spirit? For Wednesday, the 18th of July, 2018. Thank you. What do my wonderful friends need to know? Thank you. From the Fairy Tarot. For Wednesday, the 18th of July. Thank you. Okay. We have the Two of Summer, followed by the Queen of Summer, and followed by the Prince of Spring. Your first card is the Two of Summer. This is the Two of Cups, to the number of relationships, partnerships, a choice you've made to experience. This is love. True love. Unconditional love. This is a real soul connection. This is someone who who is going to partner you and take care of you as you would them. Unconditional love, love with no conditions. You know, you can kind of meet those people where they, they, they kind of give you the lip service that they would walk their walk and talk their talk, but you know their actions always show them up or their behaviour, as in you, can, you could ask them, oh yes, I'll do that for you, but... Or, yes, I, I, could, I could do that for you, but <laughs> conditions, not today. This is unconditional love. True love that can only come from within, from within your heart, with your heart centre, and, and love. Well... You can't see it, can you? It, it is a feeling. This is where I try and teach about feelings with um, using the trusty steeds because teaching riding is teaching somebody their seat. It's teaching them a feeling, a feeling I have attained and I'm trying to find as many words as possible to pass that feeling on to you. This is the same thing. Love is a feeling. It's an emotion. It's something you are feeling. But you can't actually see it. But you know it's there, you trust it's there. It's unconditional. Falling in love or making a serious commitment to someone. Forgiveness and the resolution of a problem. Don't give up. Your relationship can be healed. Next we have the Queen of Summer. The Queen of Cups. This is real more emotion, more compassion, loving, comforting, emotional, intuitive. She's aware, she's mindful, she's nurturing. She is a real she's a real family woman. She's about her family, her children, her home. She is She's the sort of person who would put 
her children first, who would put her family before herself. This can also make her... Um, she can be very defensive over her family and children, kind of um, uh, like a defensive boxer. If you back her into the corner and it's to do with her family, her children, her her animals, then then she will come out fighting. <laughs> She's a real, a real emotional energy today. And it's all about more love, more nurturing, more comforting more compassion, real motherly energy, a real awareness, a real mindfulness. Listen to your heart. Intuitive insights you can trust. Taking care of others. Perhaps too much, so maybe. Maybe as the overspill from yesterday or remembering to be a little bit selfish take that time for yourself so that you can be at your nurturing best for your family okay and next we have the prince of spring the prince of wands princes are action journey they are adventure impulse and this, this prince, he is charming, he's self-confident, he is passionate, he's, he's restless, I'm feeling he's courageous, he is brave. So there's real movement here. So for some of you, this could be a journey in the physical. Maybe some of you are going on holiday, taking a break. Maybe some of you are relocating, moving. Also with princes, we get the, with this, with this prince, it is an, it's an impulse into action I am feeling today. This prince has come along because he's, he is about a journey um, and he's impulsing you to, to move today. He's going to give you the courage and the bravery, I feel, to move today. Immediate action, a challenge you can successfully man manage a passionate relationship so back to love maybe this is you know princes or or knights um, they are about also they are chivalrous aren't they and they are about romance and um, servitude and honor so maybe this is today for some of you this is true love real love the sort of love that only you and the other person knows exists because it's only you that's having the feeling, only you that is having the experience. I'm feeling today this is unconditional love, like a mother would have for her children without condition. And I feel that this, this relationship and partnership that some of you are, are, are feeling today, and it doesn't have to be... Um, a relationship it can be a friendship where you've met a real soulmate and you've made a soul connection with somebody who would love you unconditionally it's real passion today there's real movement there's real passionate action and impulse forward and feeling courage bravery you are really feeling the mother energy today the emotions of love unconditional love you are I feel committed, commitment, you are committed to the action and the passion and the movement. Oh guys, this is really wonderful. Let's go. Um, oh, do you know, I'm drawn to the romance angels. <laughs> because I really feel this is a real, real love message. Unconditional love. do my wonderful friends need to know from spirit for wednesday the 18th of july 2018 what do my wonderful friends need to know from the angels of romance thank you so you're asked to retreat it's time to disconnect from the world. That's the journey. I feel taking the journey together, 
going off together, retreating together, you and this other person. I feel, I really feel passion. I'm feeling real emotional, unconditional love. I'm real feeling the... This is the end. I'm real going again, guys. This is the energy of of a mother as well. This is real feminine energy. This is real deep, deep emotional, unconditional love. It is going to make you want to retreat, take time to disconnect from the world around you, get to know each other, get find the passion, <laughs> get yourself in the spirit, the spirit of 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 this love that you are feeling, this emotion that you are feeling. Oh, okay, colours are drawing me. Secret Language of Colour by Inner Cigar. What do my wonderful friends need to know? From Spirit. For Wednesday, the 18th of July, 2018. What is the message for my wonderful friends from Spirit? For Wednesday, the 18th of July. Thank you. Oh, guys, you can't see that on the camera, can you? Because it's just flipped upside down. Pink. Back again. Let love in. Guys, I am telling you, the message from Spirit for some of you really is about unconditional love. For some of you, you need to learn the lesson of not putting conditions on when, you know, if somebody asks you to do something, if you can't do it, say no. Don't say yes, but, and then put lots of conditions on it. No. <laughs> if it's not 100% yes for you, then it's a no. <laughs> so no conditions. This is the message at the moment. So pink is the energy of unconditional love. Open your heart and help to heal your heart problems. It assists with releasing emotional challenges and brings tranquility. Pink also helps with insomnia and the manifestation of dreams. Become aware of any tension in your body. Take in a deep breath and allow your body to soften. Focus on letting go of any hardness or density. Close your eyes and imagine you are holding the most beautiful pink flower. Breathe in its sweet scent, inviting its beauty and delicateness to open your heart. Then imagine pink light from the flower flowing into your heart and filling it up with unconditional love. Now, think of someone you love and allow the love you feel to pour from your heart into his or hers. Savour that feeling of love and connectedness. Say, divine love, pour your healing light into my heart, softening it, purifying it and rejuvenating it so that it is shiny, loving and full of enthusiasm and then my friends your light will shine out into the world and nobody will be in, under any mistake or any illusion that you are filled with spirit filled with love filled with unconditional love and you will be walking around shining your light out into the world attracting those to you that you want to attract to you this is absolutely fantastic. Okay, Oracle of the Unicorns, Cordelia Francesca Brabs. Oh, guys, this is a wonderful message. I really feel some of you today, you're going to pick up the baton, the wand, baton, baton. <laughs> the wand, you are going to pick it up. You are going to run with it. I feel you're running towards somebody with love, emotion, you're going to let your unconditional love pour out. You're going to take the time to retreat from the world, just the two of you. Oh, now I'm singing that song, just the two of us. And no, I'm not going to sing. <laughs> but you can make it if you try. Okay. Right, okay, so we get past lives back again. Release your past life karma. 
You are an old soul with very deep wisdom. Healing your past lives will raise your vibration. So don't put the butt on your unconditional love today by going over your past lives, past loves. This is new, brand new. This is a new shiny new you, a new you that is in the pink and you are blooming today your pink flower is absolutely blooming blossoming your love is pouring out it's a, a real soul connected love it's a, a feminine love it is filling you with passion you are ready to pick up your your baton you are ready to run with this you are ready to retreat from the world you are having a real outpouring of unconditional love. But just remember, the one little thing from Spirit is reminding you, past life, remove those blocks, get rid of all of that karma. Don't repeat any patterns that you went in before. You are now in the flow of a new phase of unconditional love. Please, please, please don't block it. Don't put any blocks on it. This is the message from Spirit today. Let your unconditional love pour out from your cup. Wow. Wow. Oh, for somebody, this is an absolute fabulous, fabulous message. Well, thank you so much for all of your likes, your shares. Welcome, you subscribers. Thank you so much for your support. You have joined a wonderful family of kindred spirits and thank you too for your your warm, encouraging, kind comments. Um, I really enjoy receiving them so do keep them coming. Well if any of you would like your own personal message from Spirit um, you can always um, get a reading from me. Um, you can contact me on the email address uh, which is in the description box below. Well, I wish you all a joyful, a peaceful, a blessed and a truly unconditional loving day. And I send my unconditional love out to each and every one of you. And until tomorrow, my friends, goodbye.